It does have a CB in it. Um, I put manual gauges in it because they don't lie. The dash gauges, the oil one is not hooked up because that's where I have my manual gauge tapped in at. Okay, there was uh, some rust issues in the trunk, which didn't really show up. Let's see, we have, um, right here you got one about two and a half inches long, about a half inch long. You got a couple pinholes up here. You got a little hole right here about a half inch. But in general, the deck, you know, 70 years old. The left side is just all surface. Someone had asked me about these storage boxes. They're good and solid. The little tar paper in them's tore, but the decks are in good shape. The whole car is really what I consider to be in excellent shape for its age. You don't get to rebuild very many of them like this that haven't already been chopped on, should I say. Okay, in the passenger floorboard, we've got a little hole right here about the size of a dime, and then you got a few little pinholes, but <clears throat> all these panels are, uh, you can get all these panels new. I've got a bunch of part books, supply books that go with the car, and, and they're really inexpensive as far as car parts go. Okay, one of the other questions was about the two-speed Colombian rear end. I had tried to use it once before and this twin cable right here is stuck and that's why I never got to try it. Um, but as you can see it's all there and I have really have no reason to think that it doesn't work. Uh, I tried to do it manually but it won't unless you pull those cables and I didn't want to disconnect all that. <clears throat> I'm going to go ahead and order a new one for it but I don't know if it'll make it in in time for this. You can see all the new lines and stuff. Uh, the wiring harness has been completely replaced on it with original uh, we're looking at the voltage regulator right now all that stuff's still on it but I have switched it to an alternator it's still a 6 volt but it's alternator and uh, I still have the original generator you want to put it back on I don't know why you would um, complete new front end king pins at everything new brake cylinders pads I, I may have already said that it's got the original siren that I'm assuming the constable put in it uh, as you, you can see down there it's got red headers on it I've got the original manifolds it's got new smitty mufflers and dual exhaust all the way out the back of it I've rebuilt the carburetor, fuel pump, uh, the master cylinder, both water pumps, uh, complete rebuild in the distributor. Like I say, mechanically, it's a pretty tight car. Let's see how I start it up for you. You can see it. It's in a purge like a sewing machine.
Okay, well, I hope I answered all the questions. Uh, if you have any questions, you can email me through the eBay, and I'll try to answer them the best I can. All right, we thank you. Uh, one other thing, this will be the last time that I'll run it on eBay. Uh, I'll probably move it on to the auctions or Hemmings or something like that. So good luck with it.